<laughs> I thought you were gonna wait, so I was gonna wait. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking on my video. It truly means a lot. So, well, today, my friend and I, my, I said my friend <laughs> and I, oh my god, oh my god, okay, Christina and I, my best friend, Christina Rizzo, the oh one god. and only, so today we're, we are going to be, we're going to be doing a mukbang, 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 muk muk yeah, you know what? You know what we mean. What you, we're trying yeah, to say. you know those videos. <laughs> and for today's video, I know that a lot of YouTubers have like a bunch of food to like do mukbang, mukbang, whatever. But you know what? We're trying to get in shape or whatever so, because um, mm. our winter bodies need to come back. <laughs> For winter? <laughs> I mean, summer is like technically For, um, over. Summer 2K19. Duh. <laughs> so we got Chick-fil-A and we got 30 chicken nuggets and we got fries and a drink. And we thought it was going to come with two drinks, but it came with one drink. But it's okay because we have yeah. water. So where's your water? <laughs> <laughs> we have water, so it's cool. Yeah. First, the fries. You always gotta get that zesty buffalo sauce, you know. Mm. Or the sweet and spicy sriracha sauce. Mm -hmm. Buffalo. Wait, what's it called? The Chick fil A sauce, because. I mean, you are going to Chick fil A, right? Oh my god. It's so good. Like, it's like life changing. You know, you know what I mean? It's amazing. You know what I mean? Okay. So, I figured that since a lot of people, including us, are going back to school, we should talk about back to, to school. school but we should talk about like going back to high school like because, our high school experience and yeah like our high school experience and stuff just because we had an amazing time at high school like, it was school. really honestly like one of the best times one of the worst times you mm -hmm. meet your like true friends your fake friends yeah and me and Christina have known each other since kindergarten and we've been best friends ever since mm -hmm. and the craziest thing is that like not to be shady or anything, but I know so many people who have, like, been best friends, like, for a long time. But they go, like, on and off, on and off. And literally, our only fight this whole entire time has been about bikes. A bike. When we were, like, what, 10 years 10, old? When because ex explain why. So, I had a, what was it, like, a pink bike? And a purple, yeah. I had a pink and a purple bike. And Yasin would always come over, and she would always want the pink bike. Mm -hmm. And then I would want the pink bike, so we'd always fight mm -hmm. over it. Yeah, we'd always fight over it. And then, she doesn't remember this, but I remember my dad, he would always, like, cut her bullies, and he would never cut mine. I'd get so jealous, and I'd get so mad, so I would, like, hate her. <laughs> and Casey, you don't know what bullies are? Oh, yeah, they're, like, um... They're, like... Otter Pops. Mexican yeah, Otter yeah, Pops. Yeah, yeah, Mexican Otter Pops. The they're best. so good. And, um, I don't remember that. I remember about the fight, <laughs> the fikes. The I mean bikes. the bikes because um why do I remember? Oh, because I was outside like on the bike and she was inside crying. <laughs> and like my little devil self like didn't feel bad. So I was just outside <laughs> riding the bikes and stuff and she was inside crying. I feel like watching her through the window. <laughs> I was like crying. Like those music videos. <laughs> the cue the sad music. <laughs> no, but like I wanted the pink bike, that's why. You know, pink is cool. It's awesome. It was my bike. Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> okay. Shout out to Christina's dad for giving, for cutting my bullies, too. Yeah, he, he never cut mine. That was so funny, because I remember every time that I would cry, for, like, something, like, because I fell or I didn't feel good, you would cry, too. I would start crying. Like, it hit me. I think it's, like, that best friend reflex or whatever it's like, called. Like, literally. Like, if we're twins or something. Mm -hmm. But, like, I would be crying, and then, like, I look over, and she's crying, too. <laughs> My eyes are getting so wide. <laughs> I'm really, really emotional. Like, I'll start crying. <laughs> we both are. Yeah. That's we cry for everything. everything. <laughs> like... It's not even funny. Like, don't send me a, a sad video because I'll start we'll crying. We'll start bawling our eyes out. And sometimes it's really embarrassing because other people don't think it's, like, sad. And then we're, like, crying Oh, my God, I double out. dipped. Sorry. Cheese. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry, I do that all the time. But, like, other people don't think the video's sad. And I think it's so sad and I start crying. And, like, it's embarrassing. It's really, yeah. But whatever. Who cares? Okay, so what do you think was, like... The worst thing about high school? Mm, the worst thing probably is just like, it's kind of, well, it's not really the worst thing, 
but it's kind of sad like seeing your like friends change mm -hmm. and like your groups change and like I feel like once you hit your junior year, your senior year, oh, that's yeah. when you like start realizing who your true friends are and like who's gonna like actually stay with you, mm -hmm. you know, like stick with you. And it's kind of nice too because then you like got rid of those people that were just kind of like kind of wasted your time, I guess you can say. But yeah. it's like the times we had with them, they were good and stuff. But now it's like we mature more, and that's what you notice too. Like a lot of people mature. Not everyone, but a lot of people like Not mature. Not everyone. <laughs> Not everyone, but a lot of people like a lot of us matured and like we became more responsible and stuff. So mm -hmm. I don't know. For me, I think the worst part about high school was um, homework. <laughs> <laughs> of Literally, course. I hate homework so much. But like, I noticed that throughout my high school years, I didn't have as much homework as like other people because mm -hmm. I would like. I would see other people stress about homework and stuff They'd and complain. like yeah for me it was probably like once every three months that I would actually stress about homework but yeah. another bad thing about high school was what she was saying that you realize who your true friends are because there is um you have to be you have to watch out for those fake people mm -hmm. and uh, I guess the other bad thing about high school was um, drama but okay we are not dramatic at all mm -hmm. like we feel like it's so unnecessary. It's so useless. Like, like why? Yeah, why can't every girl just get along? Like, mm -hmm. we're all girls. Like, why can't we just all get, get along? along? <laughs> like, I don't get it. Like, It's so annoying. It's stupid, too. It's yeah. Just, uh -huh. So, I feel like an advice for, like, incoming freshmen or people that are in high school already, avoid drama at all times. It'll make high school so much more easier and, like, Trust better. Me. Like, you'll have the best experiences in high school if you, like, stay out of drama. Like, literally, what I would do is, like, if I would hear something or, like, someone say, like, they didn't like me or whatever, I'd enter one year, go out the other. Like, that's a really good advice. Like, avoid drama. Like, drama is so unnecessary. Just be nice to people. <laughs> Love hey, one another. Please. Don't be stuck up. Just talk to anyone. Make mm -hmm. friends. If you see a girl by herself, go and make friends with her. You don't know what she's going through. I don't mm -hmm. know. Dude, it's getting pretty deep. We're going to start crying right now. Literally, like, you don't know that just because you said hi to them, you made their whole entire mm -hmm. year. Like, you don't know what they're going through. Like, anything. What were the best times in high school? Honestly, the football games. My the senior year games. was probably like the best year I've had. For like same reason, I actually went to like every single event. I went to all the dances. I went to all the like football games, and like I hung out with my friends so much because before like past years, I'd only be going to school, work, school, work, school, work. Like I would mm -hmm. never like go to the events. So my senior year, like I went to every single football game, and we won CIF. I wasn't able to go to the CIF game, but I was watching it. I watched the live stream, and let me tell you. It was amazing. I so. lost my voice. <laughs> it was, yeah, so those like memories, you know. Yeah, I feel like the best part about high school for me was um, like going out to events and stuff. Mm -hmm. Make sure you go out to events. And I feel like a lot of people don't go because their like, bestie doesn't want to go. But, but hey, if you know someone else that's going, Join. just tag along mm -hmm. and go. You'll have a so fun time. Fun. Maybe sometimes an event will be boring. But I mean, at least you know what's. I mean, at least you got the you, experience. Yeah, about you it, went, you know? you know? And yeah. it's just like, it depends too who you hang out with because a lot mm -hmm. of people are like saying, like, oh, like a dance was whack, like homecoming or like prom. Oh, like it was whack, it was whack. But honestly, I kind of had fun. Mm -hmm. The DJ could have been better. But we had fun, and it all depends on who you hang out mm -hmm. with, you know? If you hang out with people that are just sitting or just like watching people dance, like, you're honestly not gonna have fun. Like, get up, go out, dance. Like, it doesn't even have to be with the boy. Like, with your friends, you know? Mm -hmm. No. It all depends on you. Mm -hmm. It's what you make out of it. Yeah. Because, um, so there was this dance I went to, and, like, the next, well, when we went back to school, because it was a weekend, um, people were saying how boring it was, like, people who saw Snapchats, mm -hmm. but everyone who went was saying that it was, like, such a good time. Even though there was probably, like, I'm not even gonna lie, like, 70 people, <laughs> we had a blast. Yeah. Like, I'll, I'll insert a video right now. <laughs> you saw that? Like, it looked it fun, fun, right? It was fun. I had an amazing time. But yeah, make sure you go out to events, have fun, and yeah, another best part about high school was meeting new people. Mm -hmm. I love meeting new people. Yeah, you get, like, 
honestly like at first it can be kind of intimidating when you're first starting school and like classes and like oh my god I don't have a friend or whatever but start talking to people like break out of that shell I used to be super shy and like would not want to like talk to anyone like I wouldn't start the conversation but like starting like say like my sophomore junior year like the last three years I started like I broke out of that shell and I started talking to people and it's just like you meet so many cool people and like you build a lot of like friendships and you find mm -hmm. people that like love the things you do and you know it's really cool mm -hmm. I love meeting new people and I, I feel like I'm super easy to talk to mm -hmm. like I'm you're really yeah yeah she if it wasn't for her we wouldn't have been friends she's the one who like approached me <laughs> in kindergarten and look at us now <laughs> mm -hmm. like if you're watching this right now and you really don't know me but you know who I am oh this is the first time you're seeing me and you oh my god a food um <laughs> like this is the first time you see me Hit me up on Instagram, Snapchat. I'm down to hang out with anybody. I'm, well, I mean, like, well, yeah. well okay, you know what I mean. <laughs> but we can go to Disneyland. We can go to the mall. Just we can out. go with you. <laughs> yeah. hey, we love meeting new people, so hit us up. We love please. making new friends, yeah. please. <laughs> um, uh, so another advice for, like, high schoolers or, like, incoming freshmen would be don't procrastinate because that's the worst thing that you can do, and it'll literally, like, your grades, you'll watch them go downfall, like, You'll watch them go downhill and don't procrastinate at all. Like, it's going to be so hard to, like, not to, but literally don't procrastinate. Don't do it. Because you'll regret it eventually. Something we regret about high school, for me, I think it would be not talking to certain people because I was, like, not embarrassed. I was shy. Yeah. But that's one. The second one is not trying hard enough. Yeah, honestly, I really regret not joining, like, clubs or being more involved in my school. Yes. Like, I really wish I was more involved because I feel like that's another way, like, to build more friendships with people and just, like, fall in love with school, even though, like, some events would be, like, the whole entire day and it'd be hard to, like, manage, like, school and those events and stuff like that. But I really wish I was more involved and, like, built... And I wish I had, like, a better re relationship with all my teachers because, honestly, if you have a good relationship mm -hmm. with your teachers, that's, like, the best thing that can happen. And with your counselor, too. Yeah. Another thing about high school. Relationships. Oh. <laughs> mm-hmm. All I gotta say about that is... It's a waste of... I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, to be honest with you guys, I've never had a boyfriend. Oh, Me my neither. God. I'm exposing myself. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, like, that's not a bad thing, though. That's not a bad thing. Um, what's it called? I feel like so many, when, okay, when I tell someone that I've never had a boyfriend, the, their response, I mean, their, like, reaction is like, are you serious? What? Never? I feel like I don't need a boyfriend right to now be happy. to be happy. In the future, hit me up. <laughs> College starting. College, College is starting. Boys. But, um, yeah, like. Have I had a thing with someone? I don't know. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> but, um, what's it called? <clears throat> don't, oh, from my experience that I've seen my, like, what I've seen my friends go through, um, don't rush things because that's, that's bad, right? That's really bad. Um, mm -hmm. don't fall for someone who calls you cute because mm -hmm. he calls 20 other girls cute. Yeah. Make sure you mm -hmm. get to know them. Like, mm -hmm. like really get to know. Oh my god, excuse me. Oh my god, excuse <laughs> me. But yeah, make sure you get to know them because that is very important. Don't like start dating like after like a week. Oh my school. god, <laughs> yes, I saw that a lot during high school. Those like, relationships won't last. And then uh, the worst thing is that a week after they're like they started dating, they start with the "I love you, mm -hmm. my little sugar bear." <laughs> like, what the hell? <laughs> How do you love someone? No, and they just week? met. They just met too. They, they just, just met. Like you guys. Like really the guy, like literally, even. just tapped her shoulder. Like, hey, do you have a pencil I can borrow? And then like they start dating. Yeah, they'll be like, oh my god, but the way so he cute. asked me though. Yeah, the way <laughs> like he when I like, touched my dad. It was so cute. <laughs> Girls and guys, if there's any guys watching this, just be careful. Yeah. I don't want you guys getting hurt. Mm -hmm. Getting hurt, like. I've seen other people go through that. And everyone's still maturing. Like, especially yeah. freshman year. Don't date no one freshman year. Mm -hmm. Don't date no one sophomore year. Wait till, like, your last years. Because freshman and sophomore year, they're still little kids, technically. And just wait. Just wait. 
the right one will come at its own time. Yeah. Thanks for finishing the game. <laughs> Another thing going back into the relationship topic is um, it, it goes for both ways, girls and guys. When you get into really in, into a re, into a relationship, don't change with your friends. Mm-hmm. That's that's a big thing. Yeah. Like I again, I don't know by experience, but I feel like anyone can make time for their friends and for their significant other. Mm-hmm. Give some time to your significant other and time to your friends. Like, yeah. But if you end up losing your friends over a guy, over a guy, that's the dumbest thing We're ever, you. and you're dumb, mm-hmm. literally. Because okay, what happens when you break up with your significant other? Who are you gonna go to? No one. It's like no one gonna be there for you anymore. Yeah, no one's gonna want to be there for you because. You turn, you on, turn them. on them. Exactly. So don't, don't switch up. Like don't, don't switch up, alright? Another big thing about high school is for sure popularity. Mm-hmm. That is honestly something you shouldn't even worry about. Don't worry don't. about popularity because once you're out of high school Who are you? <laughs> what do you benefit from popularity? Mm-hmm. You're not gonna be popular at college. No one's gonna know you. Right? I know. Col- <laughs> yeah, exactly. Do not don't 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 I can't open this. <laughs> don't waste your time trying to be popular trying to buy like the most expensive backpack the most expensive wardrobe or whatever because it doesn't matter like no one really cares honestly everyone's just trying to compete with each other it's just gonna be a waste of time you're not gonna enjoy high school because you're always worrying about oh i'm not skinny enough i'm not rich enough i can't do this i can't do that like who cares yeah, you know? like, honestly, popularity does not matter. Uh-uh. Just because you're popular doesn't mean that you're cool or better than anyone. It, do- it okay? really doesn't. And you're just like anyone else. You're literally. literally. <laughs> just enjoy high school, to be honest. Make the most out of it, really. Like, join clubs, go out with friends, go to the events. Mm-hmm. Uh, you're, you are really going to miss high school once you graduate. Mm-hmm. <laughs> well, well, some of you guys are. Yeah. Because a lot, yeah. Yeah, but make sure you're a good person, you avoid drama. That's one of the main, main things. Because drama can really. ruin your whole high school experience. Mm-hmm. Um, next one is all everything we said. Just just make sure you don't do the bad things and do the good things. Yeah. Don't um, fall under bad influences. Peer <gasps> pressure is so so real in high school. Oh do God. not fall under that. But um Appreciate your friends too, a lot. <laughs> Appreciate your friends <laughs> because then you're your gonna teachers. graduate. Everyone, you're gonna Appreciate miss them. Appreciate everything. Mm-hmm. But I feel like we've talked enough in this video about high school, and no. um, I just want to say <laughs> thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate it. And um, thanks, Christina, for being on my in Thank you. video. Oh my this is my first sit down video. Ooh. And I'm excited to be a part of it. Ooh. Um, just to let you guys know, um, I know I've been vlogging for the past three videos, but just know that this isn't just a vlogging channel. I'm gonna be doing different kinds of things. So just stay tuned. Um, yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'll leave Christina's social media down <laughs> below. Make sure to go follow her. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me too. You're welcome. <laughs> but thank you, thank you, thank you so much for watching this week's video. And I hope you guys come back. Subscribe to my bestie. She, she deserves those likes. She's been working so hard. Oh I love her. <laughs> <laughs> but thank you so much for watching. And um, just thank you. Until next time. See you <laughs> next time. Bye. Bye. Check a